I might throw up sometime in this video, but first let me explain why. So Mr. C got caught. Again. I don't think I should be commenting on it, but I think I'm going to do it anyway. My only issue is, if you gay, why do you have to bring that shit back home? Like, I think it would have been okay for everybody if he just came out instead of sticking it back into a woman. And if you love women, why do you want a man? That must mean he ain't never had no good kitty cat. Because vagina is like Lisa Ray, and I wouldn't trade that for Husky Bear. And you see how that gay dude came out and told on him? And what that nigga say? Man, she have the right to wear heels, baby. The funniest thing to me is they call what he's doing a crime. America's at a crisis, but what he's doing is a crime? So I guess murdering and raping other kids is off the list. All he's doing is looking for a nasty time with a crossdresser. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I heard the recording. Vagina? I thought you had a penis. Then they try to blame it on his Middle Eastern background. You know damn well that ain't gonna work. Because if I was cheating on my girl, I couldn't blame it on my daddy for cheating on my mama. And so what? He likes to suck some. <laughs> 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 And for those who's judging this dude, you should accept people for who they are no matter what they do, except after Labor Day. And before you judge them, look at yourself. I accept all my downfalls. See how that this big old bump right here? So chill out, Mr. C. At the end of the day, only God can judge him. We just gonna keep him in prayer. I heard he goes to Eddie Long's church for counseling. And with that being said, I'm gonna go throw up now. <laughs> Thanks for watching, subscribe, comment, like. <laughs>